not try this at home. We are trained professionals. Have you ever wanted to find out what happens when you expose a pickle to high voltage? We did too. So we're putting it to the test. Today, we'll be frying up some pickles at 120, 240, and 480 volts on our custom-built test rig. Here's Katie, our pickle professor, to tell you more. Pickles are cucumbers that have been pickled in a brine, vinegar, or other solution and left to ferment by a period of time. These solutions should result in some interesting reactions when exposed to high voltage. First up is the 120 volt test. This one measured at 2.2 amps. The sodium in the pickle's brine mixture ends up creating a salt water-like reaction in the pickle. Salt water is a good conductor because it is an electrolyte solution. Next is our 240 volt test. This one measured in at 6.4 amps. When sodium chloride dissolves in water, the water separates the positively charged sodium ion and the negatively charged chloride ion. In this equation, the sodium is the key. Pure distilled water on its own is actually not a conductor of electricity at all due to its lack of impurities. And finally, we're cranking it all the way up to 480 volts. This one went to a whopping 23.6 amps. That's all for today. Tune in next time to see what we test next.